is the max value is 4 that means we can get 5 elements in stack 0 to 4 so then we need a max value the max value should be 5 uh, this is the max max maximum number not a max value uh, then we need a top top this is the pointer from where we are going to uh, at this position we are going to delete and add values so now we need uh, four functions uh, first function is we need uh, push data so this is the type then we need pop data pop for deleting the element and push use for adding the elements then we need two more helping function this is is full and is empty this function will tell us tell us that uh, is tag is empty or is tag full or not so first of all we need uh, let you want to add a element then we need int push data so obviously you will add a value so we have to add uh, get a value in data parameter and in this function first of all we will check that is our function is already full if our stack is already full then we cannot enter more value so we will check that is full in this function we will check that if our top is greater than equal to max max value then return 1 that means tag is full else top equal to top plus one that means increment in a top and uh no here just we will return zero nothing nothing we will do anything anything else okay so our is full function is right so we need one more function uh, okay, we will we will make it later later. So Here we will check that uh, So Here we will check first of all If Is full that means is it returning one that means it is full if this is already full then we are going to print f and giving a message that stack is full else if stack is not full then what we will do we have to do top equal to top plus one then uh, add a data value on top position so fine guys so this is the 60 percent stack or uh, is completed so let's check the this part if 
push is ready then pop is very easy for you so we have an some issue first of all we have to check that okay so we don't need dollar here so let's compile and run it again yes so this is running fine now so i am going to push some data let i'm going to push three then i'm going to push nine and let's now check the values this is working fine for now this is working fine for now then we need enter some more values one okay say uh, you can add six zero one so one two three four five five values are entered uh still entered there is no error so just try to add one more value this is five see the output okay so add one more value so check this is this can be also five so you can see that stack is full that means uh the value that we are entered are overflow now so stack cannot hand, handle uh, these values so when so max value should be 5 so when uh, you can check from here top top is starting from minus one then you can check here uh, you have to check here up to minus one then it will give you the perfect result then it will give you now uh, stack is overflow because we are trying to enter six values because our stack uh, can handle only five values so fine guys so if you want to see the all values are entered or no you can check from here so we need a for loop for that i equal to I start and i less than top i plus plus this is increment and we have to print f stack here with the i value and let's run it so you can see here if you want to compare the first value is 3 then 9 then 6 then 0 after that if you are going to try to enter more values it the values are not going to enter because stack is full and our value is for uh, for position is max for that max for us so fine now we are going to remove some values so a uh, push function is completed for now let's try to pull now uh, let's try to pop the values now so for that we need to make pop function and in pop function first of all we have to check that uh, is array empty or not so because if array is already empty then how can we remove more values so here we check that if top equal to minus one we can see that top less than equal to zero then return zero 
L. Sorry, then it will return one. L. It always return zero. And here we will check if is empty. Is return one. That means true. Then stack is already empty. And of top equal to top minus one and stack on top position equal to blank value so let's try to run it so we have now three values so okay so we have to Compile and run again. So, 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 just try to one more time compile. So, this is now three nine six zero. We are just entering these values here. So, I'm going to remove it once for once and trying to pop the values. So I am going to pop one value that means uh, 0 is popped now uh, I am going to pop some values so first of all uh, because the value are always deleting the top from position that we are just removing here from the top position so uh, zero should be removed yes you can see that zero is removed so so fine guys so just cut it and just remove and Pop some more values 2, 3, 4, 5 and check the output once. You can see that stack is already empty because we all uh, move 5 values and we have just 4 values. Going to so you can see that stack is empty now because our values are remove now if we are trying to remove one more value then it will give us the error so fine guys so i think it should be uh one here this, this is minus one so now it will work fine so create so now if you have remove one more item then it will tell you that tag is already empty because you entered four elements you remove four elements and if you try to remove fifth element then it will give you the warning message so thanks guys thanks for watching our video